A hemispherical tank is made up of an iron sheet, one centimeter thick. If the inner radius is one meter, find the volume of the sheet used to make the tank. So where is this sheet iron sheet? This is the iron sheet they're talking about, this thickness. This is the whole iron sheet, okay? So this is the iron sheet. Now, how would we find the volume of this iron sheet? If you look now very carefully, this iron sheet, we have this outer volume. You have this outer volume here, the outer hemisphere. From this, from the outer hemisphere, attract the inner, inner hemisphere, this one this green thing once you subtract this what will remain behind is this is your sheet this sheet will remain behind so basically in this sum we've got to subtract the outer hemisphere volume of outer hemisphere minus volume of inner hemisphere so let's get on so we'll write two things we'll write the outer hemisphere we'll see what is the vo what are the dimensions of the outer hemisphere and now we'll see the dimensions of the inner hemisphere so the inner radius is small r and they said it's one meter and we will make it hundred centimeters so the inner radius small r is 100 centimeter let me mark it here in this cross section so this is a small r and that is 100 centimeter now they said the thickness is this is the thickness and the thickness they said is one meter one centimeter so our outer r this outer r will be the inner r plus the thickness so the outer r that is a capital r will be the inner r which is 100 plus the thickness which is 1 so the outer r will be 100 plus 1 and that is 101 so I just mark it again it will be the inner r here plus this thickness the outer r that is 100 plus 1 so we write that now the outer r equal to inner r inner radius plus thickness which is 100 plus 1 and the outer R is 101 so now we are ready for the sum so we know the volume of volume of this uh, volume of this steel was outer volume minus the inner volume so back again outer uh, radius is 101 inner radius uh, is 100 and to find volume of steel we need to do so to find the volume of steel we need to do volume of outer hemisphere minus volume of inner hemisphere let's do it again so this is my outer hemisphere and from the outer hemisphere I'm going to subtract the volume of the inner hemisphere and then what I'm left with will be this volume of this steel that I need to find out so let's put in the values so here outer hem it's a hemisphere so 2 by 3 pi outer volume minus 2 by 3 pi inner volume inner volume because inner radius inner volume so here again I do 2 by 3 pi 2 by 3 pi I can take common out what will be here r cube minus outer volume in a uh, outer radius in a radius so b 2 by 3 pi now we know our R capital R or outer R is this 101 so 101 cube minus this R is here we found it here 100 100 cube and then you do this calculation it's a huge calculation here and here you do into 22 by 7 your 101 cube is okay the calculation is long so we I found the cube here and then after you do you get the answer six three four 
8.8 centimeter cube right so this is your answer and if you want to change it to meter cube which you did not do it so remember this is 6348781 centimeter cube in centimeter 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 and if you want to change into meter to change this centimeter into meter you will do here I'll put another color so the centimeter 1 over 100 meter will be again 1 over 100 meter and again 1 over 100 meter.